Hi, it's Janie. Welcome back to my channel. And today is day four of the Hall Police Week. Yay! <laughs> and today I have a Korean skincare haul video for you. Yeah, from uh, Wish Trend. And I will be leaving a link in the description box to Wish Trend. It is affiliate link. Um, they did reach out to me and wanted to know if I would like to become an affiliate. I thought, why not? Because um, I've ordered from Wish Trend several times and they carry a lot of really good Korean skincare brands that is um, tried and true that I have tried, other people have tried, and that I have shared with you over the past year or so. And so I do have that link. You're not um, obligated to use it. I'm not trying to push it off onto you, but it is there. And um, all of these products were purchased with my own money. I did not receive anything for free. Um, I do have a couple of products that are going to be coming to me that they're going to be sending to me. And I'll talk a little bit about those. I don't actually have them yet. But I'm going to talk about one of them because, well, stay tuned to find out why I'll be talking about it. Anyway, so if you follow me on Instagram, I did post a... Um, on Instagram about a sale that Wish Trend was doing, and it was called their, um, oh Lord, now I've done forgot what it was called, the exact verbiage, um, the Cruelty Free Week. And um, a lot of their brands that they have is cruelty free, and they were um, promoting, um, doing a promotion where there were several items on the website that was going to be anywhere from 10 to 30 to 40 percent off. Plus, um, whenever you spend X amount of money, then you can receive some free gifts. I would recommend to you that if you want to know when these um, sales are going to be taking place, one of two ways. One, uh, make sure you're following me on Instagram. It is Porter Peach. And two, follow Wish Trend on YouTube because they usually do a video about any upcoming sales that they're going to be doing or promotions and what all you will receive as your free gift. Also, during that week, um, a certain percentage of proceeds was going to go to the Beagle Rescue. And that was the, um, the charity that they had decided to select to promote and to give a portion of the proceeds to. And so they had these cute little beagle um, tack pins, tie tack pins, I guess, or what do you call them? Anyway, um, with my free gift that I got, I got this one for free. And I think they were selling them for $2. There's two different ones, and this is the one that I got. But anyway, let's talk about all of the good stuff that I got to start putting on my face. Oh. I got some really, really good stuff. And everything was on sale. So I'll start with this here. This is um, by Wish Trend. This is their brand. And it's the Green Tea and Enzyme Powder Wash. Um, I really enjoy a powder wash. I have one um, that I'm using that's a rose-scented one. And I wanted a tea tree one or a green tea not tea tree, green tea, because it's supposed to be a very good antioxidant for the skin. I was trying to open this, but it's sealed. Oh, I brought my scissors so I could unseal them <laughs> and not be sitting here struggling for 30 minutes like I just did. Anyway, it just looks like this here. It's just a powder. And what I recommend if you use a powder, any type of powder cleanser or peel, um, use a micellar water when you put the powder into your hand use a micellar water to kind of um, start getting that worked into a, a paste or foam and put it onto your face and then put a little bit more micellar water and then work it around and then you can just rinse with regular tap water is my suggestion but i did get this um and then i got this one here this is from the brand i'm from I talked about the um, Magnolia um, Serum 
in a favorites video. I think the last favorites video that I did. And I have a favorites video coming up, so stay tuned for that. But anyway, I liked it so much that when I seen that they had a sleep mask, I was all on it, all on it. And all of these products were on sale, but I don't remember what the percentage of them was. But anyway, I love, I love, I love sleepy masks. I think they are a wonderful last step to add to your nighttime skin regime. And you put on their, their mask that you don't rinse off. You just put them onto your skin and then you sleep all night in them. And then the next morning you get up and cleanse your skin. But it looks like that there. And oh, it smells so good. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm. So I am definitely looking forward to giving this a go for sure. And then I got also from that brand, um, the Ginseng Serum from I'm From. And this is supposed to be a really good anti-aging, anti-inflammatory serum. So I got it. smells good <laughs> this was in a pack a dual pack and it had the serum and then the next product that I'm going to show you so there you go just like any other serum it doesn't feel sticky or tacky and it looks like it kind of absorbs right into the skin I don't see it just really sitting on top it has definitely sunk down into my skin there but then um, this was in, like I said, a, a little kit. It had the mask, the ginseng mask. And this is a rinse off mask. You put it on, leave it on for probably a good 10, 15 minutes. I haven't used any of these products yet. Um, I really wanted to first before I um, showed you any, but I just haven't had time. And I wanted to show you this because of what's going to be happening at the end of the video. This looks like it has some kind of honey in it. I mean, it looks like, can you see that? And it smells good. Hmm. It smells good. It's almost like a, um, like a woodsy, woodsy scent to it. So can't wait to do that and probably what I think what I might do after I've used these for a little while is I might come back and do like a review video of these products and then the last product that I got from I'm from is the honey cream and it looks like this year I used it today as a, a daytime moisturizer and I felt like it absorbed into the skin very well I didn't take very much of it um, now I don't really know how it worked with my makeup because I used a different sunscreen today and um, I didn't like that sunscreen. It didn't play well with makeup but and that could have been it. It could have not been this product but I'll, I'll let you know. And then the other two things that I got and this was again in a little pack and this is from the brand Coserex and I got the Ultimate Moisturizing Honey Overnight Mask. Yes, I have, I probably have three, four overnight masks sitting by my nightstand now, and I like to rotate them each night, use a different one, but anyway, here's the honey one. So now it looks like I've got three more to add. Yeah. So, <laughs> my husband's like, why do you put all that on your face? And I'm like, so I can be young and beautiful. I'm like, is it working? <laughs> of course he has to say, well, yeah, it's working. If he does it, he's in big trouble. <laughs> oh, oh, this is like a gel. I thought maybe this was going to be like a cream. But see, that's like a gel. Ooh. Oh, that smells good. Oh, that smells like honey. Well, I would hope it would, but yeah. Wow. Does it feel a little tacky? It feels like just a little bit tacky. But I bet you that will go away once it dries down a bit. Ooh, that's nice. That's really nice. And then the other one that I got um, was from Coast Rex. It's the Ultimate Nourishing Rice Over Overnight Spa Mask in a tube like that. Let's see what kind of... 
I would assume that this one would be a cream with it being the rice. Rice is very fermented products and rice is very good for your skin. Wonderful anti-aging products for your skin. You don't, I mean, you don't hear here in the States of skincare companies putting fermented products into their skincare or like um, snail mucin and all that kind of stuff. Yes, that was definitely a um, cream product. Cream to like a gel. It almost feels like a very light um, daytime moisturizer. I don't really notice any smell with that. Hmm. But that looks nice. So two more overnight masks to add to my collection. And then I did pick up some more sheet masks. I have to do that. Um, this is the 23 years old um, rose gold 24 mask. It's this here. And I have purchased these before and have used them and I got how many of these did I get I got three four five I used one of them this morning a very wonderful mask with lots and lots and lots of essence in it um, it's like a milky essence and um, has of course the smell of rose but it's not overpowering and you can leave it on for 15 minutes or you can leave it on for up to 45 minutes before it will start to dry out. Um, I like to leave them on for like a good 30 to 45 minutes. I really reap the benefits, but once you take these off, your face is just glowing and just so pretty and really do recommend these. The only gripe that I have about these and this may not be an issue for anybody else, but they do not have a mouth hole in them. That means they have opening for your eyes and for your nose, but then this right across your mouth is solid. And I am a mouth breather, so I can't breathe through my nose for a long period of time. I just can't. I just, just not how I am made. So after about five minutes, this is about as long as I can stand to have the mouth not open. So after about five minutes, I'll take a pair of scissors and cut a mouth hole in there so that I can breathe <laughs> properly the way that I've been breathing for the last 50 years of my life. <laughs> so, but other than that, I really, really do like these. They're long. They come down to about here and they have these flaps that kind of come up along here and they're just nice very nice sheet mask so I have those and then the free gifts that I got gosh I got a lot of free gifts um, you already seen the little beagle pin that I got then I got the Claire's gentle black cleansing puff and a um, by wish trend the natural vitamin 21.5 enhancing sheet mask and the Another by wish trend is the hours long moisturizing gauze sheet mask. So that was a free. Then there is the honey mask um, sample pack. I love, love, love this honey mask. Oh, it's one of my favorites. The I'm from vitamin tree, vitamin tree, vitamin tree water gel. Huh. Anyway, that was in there. And then there's the Biwish Trend Vitamin 75 Maximizing Cream, a little um, sample pack of it. And then there's these two little packets, little sachet packets that were in there, that these are chocked full of little samples of all kinds of stuff by um, the brand Claire's as I just drop them all. That's <laughs> the way everything's going. Um, so there was in here, um, the Supple Preparation Facial Toner, the um, Unscented Supple Preparation Toner, there's the Midnight Blue Calming Cream, the Gentle Black Deep Cleansing Oil, the Supple Preparation All Over Lotion, the Rich Moist Soothing Serum, the Midnight Blue Sun Lotion SPF 40. This is the um, sunscreen that I was using 
today and um, I've used it for like three days in a row. I had opened up one of these. Um, probably for the body is probably fine, but as far as putting it onto the face, it's a little bit too thick and the makeup just doesn't sit good on top of it at all. So not, didn't care for that. And then there's the Illuminating Supple Blemish Cream. The Rich Moist um, Soothing Cream. This is a really good moisturizer. I've, I have that. The Freshly Juiced Vitamin E Mask. And there's a sample of that. And then the other packet had the exact, the same samples in there. Other than the ones that I have pulled out and used. So, whew, if you have stuck with me thus far through the whole Hollapalooza week, you are in luck because I'm going to be doing a giveaway. And the giveaway is going to be um, Korean skincare. I want to share with you. First of all, I'm going to include in the giveaway all of these um, sample packs that was sent to me. All of these are going to be in the giveaway. So all of those are going to a person there. I'll put them back into this little envelope. So they don't get lost. So they don't get lost. There we go. So you're gonna get a whole pack of those samples. Also in the giveaway is going to be the sheet mask. That was the natural vitamin 21.5. I have several of these already, so I'm gonna include that one in there. That was my gift. Also this gentle black cleansing puff. I'm gonna include that in the giveaway. I am going to include in the giveaway two of these masks, the um, Rose Gold 24 mask that I just talked about. That's going to be in the box. That's going to be going to one of you guys. Also, if you would have seen in, um, I don't know what day it was, but uh, my first my first day, the first day of a Hollapalooza where I did the Pink Soul unboxing. Um, there were some products in there that I know that I won't use, so I'm going to put that in the giveaway. One is going to be the Misha Eyeshadow Trio. Also, this Gold Bar um, Face Wash Bar is going to be in there. And um, I talked about in the beginning of this video how Wish Trend is going to be sending me a couple of products. And one of the products that they're going to be sending me is this guy here from Claire's, and it's the Supple Preparation Facial Toner. Um, if you've watched any of my Korean skincare videos, you've heard me talk about the skin, the seven skin method. Um, you can Google it, you can go on YouTube and type in um, seven skin method and there'll be all kinds of videos that's gonna pop up talking about how to do the seven skin method. And this is one of the best toners to do that seven, seven skin method with because it doesn't have any alcohol in it. So it's not gonna dry out your skin, it's not gonna irritate, and you can do that seven layers, and you're gonna see wonderful results, especially after you've done it for like a good week. Do it morning and night, and you will reap the benefits. You're gonna have to put a little work into it, but not a whole lot. Anyway, they're sending me a bottle of this. I just received, or I just purchased a bottle. So I don't need another one because I just started using this one. So I'm going to put that bottle that they're sending me into the giveaway. So you're going to be getting that also. So yeah, so that is it for the giveaway. How you enter is um, first you have to be a subscriber, obviously. Um, second of all, I would like for you to just put in the comments. Oh, what are we going to put in the comments? What? Oh. oh. I know. Tell me what your upcoming summer vacation is going to be um, for this upcoming summer. What do you got planned for this summer, guys? I don't know. Um, we're planning on maybe going to Branson. Maybe in the next couple weekends. I'm not really for sure. We just did our trip to Texas. That was just a, a little quick day and a half trip. It was mostly all driving. We went down there to look at some motor homes is what we did. We didn't buy one though. Anyway, um, and I don't know. I don't know if we've really got anything else planned for this summer other than working and babysitting and 
work. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, tell me what you got planned for the summer. I would love to hear what your vacation plans are and I can maybe travel with you vicariously. Is that how you say that? Anyway, so again, thank you so much for sticking it out this week. I hope you enjoyed um, Hallpalooza week and I'll talk to you soon.